All right, guys, I'm going to show you today how to um, share folders from a Windows as your host um, operating system to Ubuntu as your guest operating system on VirtualBox. So what you're going to want to do is um, open VirtualBox and you're going to run Ubuntu. My version right now is 11.10. I know for a fact that it's worked, that this method has worked from 9.0 up to this point, so I'm sure if you're on um, a later version, it'll still work. And so once it gets open, it should look something similar to this and what you're going to want to do is come up here to devices and hit install guest editions now some menu you know it'll come up just hit ok or run yeah see it'll say run and um, it should open up a terminal basically is what you get you're going to want to type in your password and it's going to basically go through the steps mine probably says something different than yours because it's just installing over the guest edition I already had installed but whenever I first installed it it had me type yes or no because I think it said something about how it wasn't compatible with Ubuntu or something something along those lines so when it asks for you to continue type yes or abort type no just type yes hit enter and continue and now once this is done it'll say I think hit return to exit and you'll just hit enter it'll exit and you're gonna wanna come up here and um, basically reboot just your virtual OS you don't have to reboot um, your host OS okay so now that uh, you rebooted after installing guest editions you're gonna wanna go to devices I think guest editions also makes you be able to view full screen I don't know but you're gonna wanna go to devices and click shared folders and you're gonna wanna click this little green plus folder come down to other and this is where you can browse for the folder like these are your folders on your Windows system so you know you can look through them all if you wanna share your desktop hit OK and basically I'm just gonna share this folder basically what you want to remember is the folder name you know you can name it whatever you want but just remember it with the capitals or any symbols you have and you're gonna to wanna to click make permanent and just hit OK and hit OK and now the next thing you wanna do is um, pick out a a folder that you're gonna to wanna to share um, the Windows folders into Ubuntu so like here I've created um, you can just create a new folder. I've created one called Share Windows. And you're going to want to know the path on how to get there. See location. If you go to like right click on the folder and you go to properties, it's going to tell you your location. So slash home slash Avery is where it's at. And so like if I wanted to mount to that folder, I type slash home slash Avery slash share windows with the capitals. Basically, let me I'm going to show you. So you're going to want to open up terminal. I already have that open and these are the commands that you're going to want to type just give this a second hold on oh, okay there we go so you're going to want to type sudo sudo and then you're going to type the command mount space minus t space vbox for virtualbox sf shared folder and then you're going to type in the name of that folder like mine was itunes media you know yours can be whatever and now you're gonna specify the folder path to mount that so slash home slash Avery slash share windows okay then you're gonna hit enter it should ask for the password that you uh, made when you set it up and when you type it's not gonna actually show any characters being typed but just type in hit enter and basically if it comes back to this um, original text right here you know it's gone through um, as it should be so now we're going to exit share window and you know here's my music from iTunes and it's shared between now the one catch to this is once you reboot you'll have to remount it every time so you might want to create like a little word document with that command that you type which is sudo space mount space minus t space vbox sf space the name of the folder um, that you're sharing and then the pathway that you want to mount to alright so comment if you have any questions I'll try to get back to you but this should help and solve most problems